Hey and welcome to the 13th day on Iceland. Hot pots are very popular on Iceland as you can sit in hot water outdoors and enjoy the beautiful nature. In this case also our friend's house features a hot pot and it's currently covered by this grayish cover. But yesterday evening I gave it a try and I sat outdoors in warm water and I enjoyed this beautiful landscape. Moreover, I was able to enjoy the beautiful reddish clouds as it was late in the evening. But I think I'm a little bit too active for just sitting inside this warm water because after a couple of minutes it got a little bit boring and I had the desire to explore this nearby stream or to hike on top of the nearest mountain. And well, in this case I'm not uh, really a hot pot person, but I have to admit that it's really relaxing to be sitting outdoors in hot water and to enjoy the beautiful landscape or to look into the sky and to enjoy the reddish clouds during the evening. However, I think it could be a little bit more interesting if you are sitting in a hot pot during the winter time, during a snowstorm or during the night when you can see some northern lights. And well, in this case, I think I have to give it another try once these conditions are met. Unfortunately, today is our last day at our friend's house and so I have now to continue to pack my things and so I think I will now get back inside and continue preparing our departure. And well, before I will do this, I just like to show you this amazing view. Down there is a beautiful small stream and yeah, I really thought I have to explore this as I was sitting yesterday evening in the hot pot. But as I said, I was sitting in the warm water and at first I would have needed a, um, a towel and uh, my clothes. And so I had not the chance to explore it right away. So, okay, um, I think I have to get back indoors again and it even starts to drizzle again. That's really sad. And yeah, so I think we will now get back in and I hope I will see you in the next adventure. So, we have arrived at our destination for today and we just finished our dinner and now I had the desire to step outdoors a bit and to explore a little bit more the vicinity of our hotel and look what I found. I am surrounded by trees. I am standing in the middle of a small tiny little forest and wow that's really surprising and in this case I thought I have to bring you back in and I have to show you that I am surrounded by trees and that I am standing in a forest and well that's really refreshing especially after a long day on the road and well we also visited a city. We spent most of the time of our journey to this destination in Akureyri, the second largest city of Iceland and so yeah I'm really glad to be here now out in the nature again and to be completely alone because yeah it was really surprising to be uh, among so many other people in Akureyri after we spent more than a week more or less completely alone. Well of course we were out to the grocery store and so we also saw other people but in general it was nothing compared to be back in a city and yeah so I'm really glad to be now out in the nature and to be completely alone and well it's so special to be now out in a small little forest and to be surrounded by trees and well as i said we spent the day in Akureyri, the second largest city of iceland and yeah i really like Akureyri. it is a beautiful city it was interesting to see really large ships lying in the harbor and to explore a little bit there the city and the small little shops and yeah it was really nice the only third thing was that it was raining all day long and so yeah it was raining while we were on the road, it was raining while we were in Akureyri. Uh, but now finally the rain stopped and well I'm not quite sure if you can see this but um, there is some blue sky and yeah that's, that's really cool. And well then we arrived at our hotel. Yeah now I as I said had the desire to step outdoors a bit and to relax a bit and now I'm here and I just thought I should bring you back in 
And well, now I think I will continue to explore a little bit more of this small little village where we will stay overnight. And well, I hope I see you for the next adventure.